the one, the only, Ben Sion. Good morning and welcome to Yeshiva YouTube Daily Double as we start the sixth paragraph of Masechah's Yuma, Mishnah is Aleph and Bez. Mishnah Aleph says, Shnei Siyuri, Yom HaKippur, Mitzvah, and Shiyu Shneihem, Shabin, Bamare, Uvakoma, Uvedamim, Uvalikikasan, Keechad. We mentioned there's two Siyur, two he goats that were meant for one was Lashem, one was Lazaza, a pair. We talked about already in Perik Dalid where he did the lottery. One was Lashem, one was Azazel. These two Seirim are supposed to be bought together. They're supposed to be identical in how they look and their height and how much they cost. Um, the Gemara learns this out from different Psukim where it says Shnei Seirim, or repeat Shnei Seirim to tell you that they'd be alike. It says that three times. If they're not exactly similar, even if you bought one today, one tomorrow, even though you're supposed to buy them together, it's kosher. If one of them died before you had the chance to bring them as karbonos, before you did the lottery, he got to do the Then neither of them is specified as Lashem or Lazazel. So therefore, you just take a second one, and then you have two animals. Let's say one was already designated as Lashem, and one was Azazel. Then you already have to bring two new animals. It's just saying, if the one that died was the one that was Lashem, so out of the new pair, you say basically the new one, which now you do a new Goral, is shame, is in place of the one that's dead. It's the Azazel one that died. So then, out of the new pair, the one that's now the next Azazel is in place of the other one. Vashani, right, you're now left with either two La Shem or two La Azazel. The original Shem or the original Azazel that's left over, you let it graze until it gets a, a mum kavu, a blemish, a permanent blemish. Once you get that, so it's considered Psule and Mukdash, it's considered something which loses Kedusha. And you could sell it for money, and the money, the Kedusha goes on to the money, and uh, the money is used for a carbon and dove. Even though there's a concept that a Chatas, a carbon Chatas, belongs to a Yachid, belongs to an individual, um, under five circumstances, you let the animal actually die. You put it in a room, you don't feed it, let it die. This is a Chatas Sibor. It's for the entire Sibor, for all of So it doesn't die. Rabbi Yehuda Omer, Rabbi Yehuda argues, Thomas, he says, even a Chatas Sibor dies. But what about Rabbi Yehuda? Nishpa Chadam, Yamas HaMishaleach, Mesa HaMishaleach, Yishafei Chadam. He says, let's say you designated one as Lashem, one as Lazazel. And you shechted the one Lashem, right? And then before you had a chance to do all the Zerikos Hadam, to throw the blood on, on in the Kodesh HaKadoshim, towards the Kodesh HaKadoshim, on the Mizbeach Hazav, the blood spilt. Yom is HaMishaleach. So it's a pair. So the one that's designated Lazazel is Nidchen. Pali Chaim Nidachim is pushed away, and you have to get a new pair. Mes HaMishaleach, Yishafei Hadam. Let's see, even if he had a chance before, he sprinkles the blood, right? The Azazel dies. So everyone over here says, so therefore, again, you have to get a new pair because you need everything to be done with that pair. If the blood is spilled, if the blood, if the, the Mishaleach, the Azazel, its mitzvah was not done, it wasn't pushed off a cliff, so then even the blood is of the Lashem is existent, you don't sprinkle it. Bez, Balo, Eitzel, Sawyer, Amishaleach, you come to the Sir Mishaleah, the Kohen does. Besomishte Yadavalav, Misvada. And he would do Vidoy on the Sir. We're going to talk more in the Kohen Mishnayas about the process of sending the Sir Lazazel off the cliff. Besomishte Yadavalav, Misvada. Kahi, Omer, Ana Hashem, Avu, Pashu, Chatol, Fanach, Amcha, Beisrael. They all send them to you, Hashem. Klaal Yitzhak, Ana Beshem, Kapren, Alavonus, Abshem, Chatoim. Erase all the sins of Klaal Yitzhak, Shavu. This is your chance for a kampara. The rest of the Quran and the nation would stand in the Azara. When he mentioned Hashem's name in the Pasuk, which he would say explicitly, he would say, he wouldn't say Ado, he would say Yudke Bavke. When they heard this in the Mesa Megdash, the proper response is Baruch Shem Kavod Machatzali Alam Bed. We know there's another Avodim Kippur. People go down and bow on the ground to reconnect to that Avoda. 
Stay tuned for Emit Sion where I talk about what is the difference between Shira, Shira Hashem and Shira Azazel? What do they both represent? I know the Ramban talks at, a, at length about what a Shira Azazel exactly means. I'll give you my interpretation. Ian with Sion coming up next.